Kremlin doesn't care about quality of army, marginalized groups are recruited for military service. The Kremlin has ordered regional officials to file weekly reports on the recruitment of marginalized people in Russia for its war in Ukraine, the investigative news website iStories reported, citing an official letter it obtained. The letter lists the office of the presidential envoy to Russia's central federal district as the author and states that military recruitment orders have been in place since March the 1st, 2023. iStories notes that an attached document identified some 22 disadvantaged categories of Russians who are targeted for contract-based recruitment into the military. Additional instructions order regional officials to track the number of people who are approached and agree to sign military contracts on a weekly basis. Priority targets for war recruitment are reportedly given to migrants and recently naturalized citizens as well as debtors and the unemployed. It feels like they're getting rid of a marginalized layer of society. An anonymous recruitment officer in one of Russia's regions was quoted as saying by ice stories. They don't care at all about the quality of the army, the officer added. They don't care what will happen to the recruits' families after they're deployed. The recruitment letter reveals that the Russian military still struggles to motivate people to voluntarily sign up for its war in Ukraine, said Sergei Krivenko, who heads the NGO Citizen, Army and the Law. Signing a contract is still voluntary, but it's possible to persuade, set conditions or make life unbearable, Krivenko told iStories. If everything was so good and people were signing contracts themselves, we wouldn't need all these tricks and efforts by regional authorities or monitor and kick those regional authorities.